We're just seeing too many people die at, all the time. And it's knowing that there's a solution out here, it's very, very hard. New reports reveal two little known drugs are having a deadly impact on the drug overdose crisis and local autopsy reports reveal they're here in Knoxville. Reporter Mary Klingler explains what those drugs are and how they're proving to be even more dangerous. They press them into fake pills. The Knoxville area recorded 770 unintentional drug overdose deaths from November 2020 to August last year. 74 of those involving parafluorofentanyl and metonitazine. Drug dealers are smart. They're trying to cut their real drugs like cocaine and heroin to make them go further so they can make more money. According to the CDC, it's harder to save someone's life if they overdose from these kind of drugs. It says additional doses of naloxone Zone, the medicine that reverses an OD may be required when these new drugs are involved. Sometimes they have to do three, four, five doses. Which the Metro Drug Coalition executive director says is causing more people to die. People wake up and because they're doing something illegal in many cases, they're afraid to seek medical care. And so they'll refuse to be transported to the hospital. She says people need to understand medical professionals save lives and don't often arrest people unless they're distributing drugs. You may think you're buying cocaine or heroin, but it's not pure. It's mixed and laced with these other very dangerous drugs. The MDC is working to combat drug addiction right here in Knoxville, preparing to open a new facility. I used um, substances off and on for 25 years. Jason Goodman is the director of the recovery training. They poured into my life, so what I'm doing every day and what I'm doing with this team here at MDC is we're, we're looking to give that back. Reporting in Knoxville, I'm Mary Klingler. Experts say the pandemic has also added to the overdose crisis. They say it's left drug users socially isolated and unable to get the treatment or support they need. If you or someone you know is struggling with drug addiction, help is available. You can call the Tennessee Red Line any day of the week at any time.